getting ready to go pick up my groceries um, at Walmart. I ordered them online through the Walmart app and um, I'm getting ready to go pick them up between 8 and 9 a.m. is the hours that I chose to um, go pick them up and right now I'm currently driving so what I did last night, y'all, is I went ahead and I went to walmart.com and I ordered my groceries. And um, I was kind of on the fence about it because, you know, I usually order, <clears throat> excuse me, I usually order a lot of groceries, but um, last night I kind of did below $100 because I wanted to check it out to see how it was gonna go. And um, it said that they would email me. Oh, I got to I got to choose a pickup time, and that's why I chose the hours 8 a.m. through 9 a.m. And um, what what I thought was cool is because when I did go on there, it was like midnight. So the fact that they still had those hours, you know, open, you know, I thought that was pretty cool. But anyways they said they would email me when my order was ready and they ended up emailing me around I'll, I'll say about 7 45 this morning and said that my order was ready so I'm on my way and they said that you know to go ahead and log on to the Walmart app and so what I did is I downloaded the Walmart app last night and um, when I went on there today, it told me to, you know, let them know when I was actually going to be there. So I had to check in and I clicked the check in button. And when I did that, it asked me for the color of the car that I would be arriving in. So I told them the color of the car I would be arriving in. So right now you guys are going to see up close firsthand the very first time that I do this so um I hope everything turns out well because this is this will be a really big help for me and you know I just wanted to bring you guys along in case you know any of you guys was curious about the Walmart pickup because I know it can be a lifesaver if everything goes right and oh I did get an email that said um, something about like four of my items were out of stock and then they substituted my cheese. I got a 24 pack, but they substituted that for a 16 pack. So I hope when they did the substitution <laughs> that they also put the money back somehow, you know, refunded me the money, you know, and also refunded me the money for the out of stock items. But, you know, I don't know, we'll see. And um, there would be a lot of cars on the road. I thought, you know, getting out around this time, the cars would be kind of slim, but, well, I guess you got people going to work, so. Yeah, but anyway, as soon as I get there, y'all, I'm gonna turn my camera on and, you know, just let y'all see kind of up close and personal the experience because I hope everything turns out well if y'all didn't know I have four kids and you know they just started going back to school so I have to keep a lot of groceries in my house because for some reason when they come home y'all they be acting like they just be starving and I don't know what the deal is with that but <laughs> um yeah I ordered a lot of kind of like stuff that they can just put in the microwave and you know oh and I wanted to tell y'all too that I'm homeschooling my youngest son he's six so you know he has to eat throughout the day as well and um like I said y'all this would just be good because it's fast you know very convenient you don't have to like you know get inside the store and shop and I don't know about y'all, but usually when I go to Walmart, I say, you know what? I'm only gonna get a couple of things. And walk, 
wind up walking out of there with things I ain't even heard of before. So with that being said, this right here will help me kind of stay on track, you know, because shopping online for groceries, you can follow kind of like what your list, you know, if you make a list, you know, I do recommend making a list of what you need. You can kind of follow that and, you know, <laughs> hopefully stick to the list. But anyways, y'all, stay tuned because I'm almost there. Oh, uh, me too, so. <laughs> this is for you. Oh, okay. What is this? It's just a little goodie bag with a bunch of stuff in it. Oh, well, thank you. And then this is just saying you'll get a confirmation email. Okay. And in the email, there's going to be a survey. If you could let us know how we did, that'd be greatly appreciated. If you could mention my name, that'd be very helpful too. Okay, Miguel. Okay, yes, thank you. And then there were some items that we did not have. Okay. It's the, the poppin' chicken. The... Pig Sweet Farms Helper Seasoning Blend, mm -hmm. the Hazelnut Spread, and then the Thin Sliced Premium Oven Roasted Turkey Breast. Okay, I think I got an email about that. Okay, and then everything else we had. Okay. If I could just get your signature right here. Okay, so what do y'all do? Y'all just um, refund that back or? How yeah, oh. those, you won't be charged for the items that you, we didn't have. Okay. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Yeah, this was very easy. Wow. Did you want the bread in the front seat with you or just back there? I'll just hold on to that. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Miguel. You have a good day. Get you some rest. Bye-bye. <laughs> Aw, look at this, y'all. I got like a, a goodie bag he gave to me. Let's see what's in here. Let's see. I wasn't expecting that. Dove Men Care Foaming Body Wash. I can give this to Hubby. Let's see what else is in here. Takis. My daughter would love those. Celebrate the dog days of summer. Some type of see oh some coupons in here we do have two dogs so that'll work and what's this something from Hallmark mm -hmm. and let's see Ooh, I can give this to my little boy. Okay, that's good. A juicy pack. And he would also like some fruit snacks. So, good job, Walmart. Good job. For the pickup, it was a success. 
well you know what I don't want to talk too soon but I'm going to take y'all back home with me so we can unpack this and make sure that everything that I ordered is in the bags. And these are all the bags back here, guys. Stuff that I got. These are all the bags. And as y'all seen, the only reason why I got out was because I was recording. But um, I didn't have to get out if I didn't want to. So just pulled up here to the parking lot I put on the um, app what color car I was pulling up in and he came right out all right y'all stay tuned I'll be home and then we can unload all of the stuff that I got A success look at all of these goodies everything was accounted for my chips my nutri grain bars all of my sweet and sour chickens my two actually I got four um, chicken pot pies my two meatloaf dinners all of the chicken finger and fries dinners two oatmeal pie boxes back there I got my two Prego spaghetti sauces. They said they substituted the cheese. Um, I got the, I originally ordered the 24 pack, but they said they substituted that cheese for a 16 pack. But what's so weird is I still got the 24 pack. So that was a win. And then two lean orange chickens, two lean sesame chicken. I got my grape jelly, my corn dogs, my um, popcorn chicken with smiley fries. I got two loaves of bread. I got my gallon of milk and I got my frosted flake cereal. So I got all of this. And also y'all, I had forgot to mention, I had got a $10 off coupon sent to my email address. And um, I did get $10 off, so that brought my total down to $92 and some change. But um, also, um, there was like four or five items that I did order that was out of stock, so they didn't charge me for that. So I'm getting ready to get off with you guys and call customer service to make sure that they you know, didn't really charge me for that just to be on the safe side but i did want to let you guys know that it seemed like everything was here that was supposed to be here so i'm giving that a thumbs up for the um, pickup so if you guys did like this video make sure you also give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and also comment you know tell me your thoughts all right, y'all, stay tuned for the next video, and we have fun, so be on the lookout for more. All right, y'all, talk to y'all soon. Bye.